Carolina Today. I'm Alex Butler. I'm Valani Calloway. Great show for you today. Author Jason Mott is here, and you may not know his name, or you may, but you've probably seen his work. One of his books, his very first book, turned into a TV show, and now his second book, The Wonder of All Things, has been optioned for a movie. He's yeah. got it going on, so we're going to talk to him. And one of those books is in its second season, The Resurrection or whatever, so yeah. it's cool stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, plus we are making catfish, catfish sausage. Is it catfish sausage? Yeah, catfish sausage, sausage vinaigrette. vinaigrette. <laughs> well, Fred is making like, it at Fred Whole Foods. Is, that's yeah. right. And we're going to do some science experience, experiments, things that you can do <laughs> at home with your child with the mad scientist. So lots of cool stuff. Plus, we, of course, have to thank. You might see that we're outside right now because yes. we are thanking sun pools for giving us these cozy chairs, of course, out here on the front lawn of WNCN. Lovely patio furniture here. It's so comfy and pretty and just make sure you check out Rising Sun Pools, a couple of locations in the area, and they'll hook you up with some lovely patio furniture. So thank you so much to them. All right. Could so, you live without your plastic grocery bags? See, I don't know if I could. I have to be honest. Here in Raleigh, when we go to the supermarket, we have plastic bags that we use all the time. But in California, they have officially banned plastic bags. So you have to ask yourself, you, okay, you're clapping on this. Yes, yes, I am. Okay, well, she's for the environment. Save That's the good. earth. Save I, the earth. I'm about saving the earth, too. But I feel like a lot of us might forget. You'll go to the supermarket and you'll forget your your bag. Well, California you to is going to force you to be disciplined. That's right. So you're going to have to be disciplined. <laughs> Although I feel like they're a little bit ahead. I did live in California once and they always, a lot of people there at Whole Foods would bring mm -hmm. their own bags. Mm -hmm. You do that. You're good about it. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if you can be good about it, I guess it's definitely something to get into. So in California, it's banned statewide. statewide. So if you show up at the grocery store without a bag, then, they're going to charge you? Yes, 10 cents. And you if, you if you still need to get food, you'll have to pay 10 cents for a reusable bag. Or walk out like yeah, this, like like Costco. Everything in your arm. <laughs> That's what I was saying earlier. At Costco, if you remember, at Costco and BJ's, they yeah. give you the boxes. Husband mm -hmm. will be running out. Maybe we could find a box at yeah. the store or something. Yeah. So, well, yeah, I think it's a, go a good that. thing. Okay, this writer created something called a TSOP score. Okay. You ever heard of a TSOP no, score? No, I have not. I have okay, not. TSOP. Time, eyes, are spending on phone. Oh, it's like an acronym. Okay. It's time. an acronym. Yeah. Okay. And so he created this because he felt like he was spending so much time looking down at his phone. Which is me. While he was supposed to be watching TV shows. Yes, do you this do is that? my life. This is my life. You yes, do that a lot? I do. I watch shows and I'm on my phone. I'm on Facebook. I'm multitasking. I'm on Twitter. Mm -hmm. Someone tweeted me. Yes. I mean, now you all know me. It's true. With me, it depends on what the show is. I if guess it's one true. of those shows that I really like... I sit down and I pay attention. Really? I don't want any interruptions. I don't want to miss and a if you, thing. And if your phone goes off with like a little bing, you don't look? Might look. Don't lie. Or sometimes I'll leave the phone away. Downstairs watching, I'll leave the phone upstairs. Really? Yeah. It depends on like what the show is. Now, if it's something that I don't care about that much, then yeah, then I'm yeah. on the phone. I guess so. But I feel like people out there, for the most part, probably have a TSOP score. How do you yeah. rate it? Is it, high, is it higher based on... Depends on the show. Oh, depends on the show. Yeah, All right, depends well, on the show or the, whatever what is on. Is. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it's, you know, something that a lot more of us are doing these That's days. True. And pr producer Kim brought up a good point. She said she'll be watching something and say, this is just dumb. I wonder if other people think <laughs> this is as dumb and as I And then go I on Twitter and look it up. I have done that. You have? Numerous times just to see if anybody's saying what I'm thinking. And yes. I guess that's true. I'll see people write on Facebook like about scandal and be like, mm -hmm. oh my God, scandal just got cray. Yeah. You know what? I'll be like, it so did. Uh -huh. So I kind of look for it for confirmation <laughs> if I miss something. So yeah. But okay. So speaking of interesting things on television, mm -hmm. of course, there are movies out there that we all quote all the time. Yes. But are there most quotable movies? Apparently a British website has made the most quotable movies. Is that right? Yes. It has this list of the nine most quotable movies. And out of all of them, I've seen one. <laughs> this list is bunk. There's a lot. There's I don't plane, like it. Mean Girls, which Mean Girls, I know. You've seen Mean Girls, no? No. Really? Mm -mm. It came That's out so in fetch. 2004. Erica, That's so fetch. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. No. Mean girls. Uh, Bill and Ted's Ted. excellent. Okay, what about no. that one? What? No. Monty Python, no. What? Party Casablanca, on no. Pulp Fiction, yes. Pulp Fiction. Okay, she got one. And my favorite quote has cuss words, so I can't okay. tell you what it is. <laughs> <laughs> well, but producer Drew says it so well, and when we're done, I'm going to ask him to say it. You should make him say it now. He can't like, say it now. Right, we right, wanted right. to keep his job. You know what's the beat? He should just say the beat. Say beat. <laughs> it's 
so good. Okay, okay, but okay. if I were making a list, Forrest Gump would have to be on the list. Oh, Forrest Gump. There are so yeah. many great quotes. Life is nothing like a box. Life is oh, like a please, box, that's of it. Chocolate. Like a box of chocolate. Mama, I buried you here <laughs> under this tree. <laughs> and when Jenny says to Forrest, I named him Forrest just like his daddy. You yes. have a daddy named Forrest? No, Forrest. He's your oh son. Oh, my God. How could Forrest Gump <laughs> not be on this list? Yes, I agree wholeheartedly. Clueless should have been list. on there too. You were talking about that. Yeah, earlier. Clueless should have been on there. I totally The thought. color purple's not on the list. Oh my gosh. I know. That's a good one too, the color purple. Yeah, this you show me. The British ugly. need to revisit their list <laughs> and check with Volanda before they move on. With their yeah, they didn't ask me what I thought. They didn't ask Volanda. Obviously. Obviously, because <laughs> she just went through the whole rendition of a scene. Oh my gosh. All right, so lots going on. We also have a couple of things. One other thing. Meow Mix, right? This is the weirdest commercial. Okay, it's a country love song. A country a love song. A man and his cat. <laughs> it's a Meow Mix commercial. Take a look. To feed his cat, because you know that's where the party's at. A quiet night at home, a dinner for two, and the song is ringing, but we're not moving. I love that he's like, Meow, 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 meow. That's the one part I heard you playing earlier. Mm -hmm. In his chorus, he goes, meow, meow, meow. Meow, it's meow, meow. got a good hook. It does have a good hook. I'm not going to lie. We might hear this on the radio meow, soon. Meow, 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 <laughs> meow, 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 More power weird. to them for their advertising, of course. Advertising going a long way when you're getting actually a hot hunk country music star to lay with his feline and be like, you're a my baby. A little odd, but it is catchy. All okay. Right. The Bank of America 500 is Saturday, October 11th. We are giving away five family four packs of tickets. Go to MyCarolinaToday.com and click on contest on the right side of the page so that you can enter to win those tickets. All right. Plus, we've also got our brownies, which we're getting into, the yum yum and the tum tum. I, of course, need to eat a little bitey bitey in because the Because Papa morning. John's is the oh. Official, official sponsor. Yes. Of course, of this big event. So that's Look at those going brownies, on. pizza and brownies. Mm, yummy in the tummy. Wait, give me one more piece oh, there. Okay, enjoy. Okay, gotta get into it. <laughs> Talk about the Super Chevy Show. The Super Chevy Show is this Friday, October 3rd through Sunday, October 5th at Rockingham Dragway. Family four pack of tickets to give away. Once again, go to mycarolinestoday.com and click on contest to enter. And I will not do my Super Chevy voice again <laughs> I was because ask I was you to forced. Do it. do it. Do the tease in your voice. Oh, gosh. It hurts, Alex. It <laughs> hurts. It. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I don't have any water. Right, no. it's okay. Go to our website and watch yesterday. When 